Hello FaceTube and social media and welcome to the Litchfield Garrick. It is Christmas Day so from us to you a very Merry Christmas. Uh, now it is the Alternative Speed Show. Today I am joined with my son Jack Trot and of course Gordon. Say hello you two. Hello. You are right. That's it. They never do it at the same time for some reason. <laughs> uh, now normally at this point we like to look back at what's happened throughout the year but this year we thought we'd also look forward because we want to be positive. Well you're not Covid positive. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. No we're just going to be mentally positive. Mentally. We want to Think about what's going to happen yeah. for the positive reasons of next yes. year. But there, are, there have been some good things that have happened in 2020, yes. though, haven't there? I mean, my favourite thing, now lots of people say, what was your favourite thing, Dolly? And I say, there was one good thing that happened for the whole of the Covids, awesome. and that was Eat Out to Help Out. I rather took advantage of that, I have to <laughs> yes. say. Did you take advantage of it at all? Oh, I loved the Eat Out to Help Out. Yeah. Did you? What did you have? Uh, I had four Nandos in one afternoon. <laughs> that is impressive. <laughs> you know when you go to Nandos? Yeah. Uh, what's, what's the name of the uh, the sauce you put on the chicken? Oh, peri peri sauce. I wasn't asking you. I was asking Gordon. Oh, I think it's peri. I think it's peri no, no, peri I'm, sauce. I'm, I'm, I'm definitely asking Gordon the name of that sauce. Gordon, <laughs> Gordon. Yeah. What is the name of the sauce you, your furry little monkey, put on the chicken? <laughs> He's dumped you in it here, isn't he? <laughs> yes. It's uh, it's peri peri sauce. <laughs> Now, if you were to go to Nando's, Gordon, how how spicy do you like your peri peri? Oh, really spicy. Really yeah. spicy. Now, do you think if we ask really nicely, the nice people at Nando's are going to send us a black card? Oh, yes, please. Ask yeah. them nicely, Gordon. Can we please have one of your black cards, please? <laughs> now, Gordon, have you got a wallet to put it in? Uh, no, no. <laughs> not wearing anything. <laughs> <laughs> no, you are in the knot, actually, aren't you? I haven't thought about that until now. Anyway, we want to look forward as well, because... Because we've looked back, we've thought about eight out to help out, but let's look forward. Yes. It is Christmas yeah. Day and nearly New Year's Day, so 2021 is arriving. So what is going to be around next year? Well, of course, theatre will hopefully be back. There is going to yeah. be shows being booked in here at the Litchfield Garrick. But also, one of the big things that's happening, which has been moved, but it's still called the thing that was called last year, which has thrown me off slightly. Right. Uh, the Tokyo 2020 Olympic Games will be happening in 2021. But still called the Tokyo 2020 Olympic they Games. They are. They've not changed the name because oh. the branding was already done. <laughs> so they're still calling it uh, Tokyo 2020. Now, Gordon, if you were to compete in the Olympics, what would your sport be? Yeah, what would it be? Uh, probably like the banana eating competition. <laughs> no. I don't think, really? that, really? don't think that's a sport. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I would. I think I hold the record for eating them. This is genuine. <laughs> I think I hold the record for eating the most bananas in a minute. Like actually, yeah, yeah. I actually what? I tried it once. <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean you tried it once? Well, oh, I, it's just something I'll do of an afternoon. Well, I'd seen that. You know the Ferrero Rocher. Challenge yes, going yeah. around, and I found out I was terribly bad. I thought oh, I can demolish six Ferrero Rochers. Looks easy. Looks easy. Uh, feel free to send any of those as well. But <laughs> no, nowhere near the record of Ferrero Rochers. Right. Could not do it. And then I was looking at other things. I thought I could, might be able to demolish in a minute. So I thought I'd be able to. You have to peel it and everything. Um, and I think I held the record for the most bananas eaten in a minute. Okay, we've got to we've got to delve more into this. How many bananas is the most in a minute? The most bananas in a minute. How many is it? <laughs> four. Oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> say four bananas in a minute. It's four. harder than you think. <laughs> the, 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 the best thing about it, I had a headache for two days. <laughs> I got a headache from the potassium. <laughs> oh, that is incredible. No, yeah. well, the best thing about this was where I did the banana eating challenge. Oh, no. I thought it would make a great radio feature. No, no. <laughs> Basically. You did banana eating on the radio. I did. I said, right, I'm going to time myself for a minute. And it was just a minute of me munching. No. <laughs> anyway. Then our positive look backs and look forwards over the past year. We hope we've brought you a little bit of laughter. We know we're laughing um, because at the moment, what else have we got to do? We were so close to bringing you a panto this year. Hopefully you've had a chance to watch it online. If you haven't yet, please go and watch it. You can go to the website. There is a link on there and you can watch myself, Max Fulham from CBBS, and of course, Gordon the Monkey in our online panto, Jack and the Beanstalk. We'd love you to watch. And remember, we will be bringing live theatre back in 20. 2021. Have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. See ya. Bye bye, everybody.